Hey, hello. This is Andrea. And Bob. And Bob. Woo! I don't know why I said woo. Woo! Because we're awesome. We're exciting people. We got away from the house. We're kid free for Leave 20 minutes. Leave the children at home. No more kids in the car when we're vlogging, right, hon? Yeah, lesson learned. The amount of stuff I have to edit out when either of them's in here. It took you, what, two days? Two full days, I think, to edit that one video? Well, I was doing other stuff, too, but... Oh, my God. You have, like, an hour and a half of video, of video and you edit it down to, like, ten minutes. I don't... I think it was 15 Because you have to take 20, all, of, all of the, our one son's... He, out. he was saying really rude stuff. Like, he was saying it as a joke because, you know, he thinks he's funny, but... So you wanted to talk about... Oh, that was a possible topic. Oh. <laughs> well, you can talk about it. Bob's got a hobby he's working on. Yeah, I'm into old computers. I grew up in the 80s. I had my first computer that I owned was a Commodore. Well, I... My um, my mom several years ago gave me um, a whole bunch of Commodore stuff to include my original Commodore 64. I also have my brother's Commodore 64, so I have two Commodore 64s. Maybe he wants it back. Yeah, he doesn't. <laughs> maybe he does. So, but I've been wanting to. I, I look at a lot of um, retro gaming on PC and on other things like 8-bit stuff. Um, one of my favorite guys to watch is 8-Bit Guy. And um, they, there's a lot of, it's kind of having a resurgence now with, um, there's a new computer coming out um, called the Commander 16, which I'm looking forward to getting. It's an 8-Bit kind of computer. So I'm into all the retro computing stuff. Wouldn't it be a 16-Bit? It is a 16-Bit. <laughs> I think it is. No, it's 8-bit, I think. So oh, his 8-bit no. guy, I bet he's not very animated. <laughs> uh, That's an old person joke. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So I've been wanting to start using my Commodore again. So we've got the den quite a bit cleaned out, and I'm setting, I have it all set up again in there. And one of the things you can't do is you don't you want to use one of the old-fashioned, they call them bricks, these big power supplies, because the old power supplies go bad, and they'll fry your computer. So I haven't used it because I wanted to get a new power supply. So I ordered a new power supply, what, a month and a half ago, I guess? It came from Poland, um, but it's really nice. It's, I'm looking forward to using it. And I went to hook up my video, and I don't have the video cable, so I have to. I had to order one of those. I'm getting that on Friday. So I've been trying to use my my Commodore stuff for I don't know a couple of years, and I'm I'm almost there. You're not trying hard enough. I know, but I've been. Why well, keep putting that off? Yeah, put it off. I got other things to do, like puzzles and home house stuff and things like that. So yeah, yeah. Life, life comes. In. Nothing exciting. It's just one of my hobbies. I've been wanting to get back into. What about when um when we were dating before oh I had my Commodore 64? In high school. He's in high school. About. And uh, she would come over and I'd play music on on it for her. All right, wait a minute. I don't think you're giving a full picture here. So we'd no? be up in his room, okay, which sounds, maybe it sounds romantic, but it wasn't. And uh, he's sitting at a little desk or a table. He's got the computer on and there's one chair. He's sitting in a chair, and I'm standing behind him, watching him do whatever he does on the computer. That's fascinating, baby. You were sitting on the Great bed. News. Mine might have been on the bed, but the bed was far from the thing, so sometimes yeah. I had to stand up and look. He had he had Star Wars curtains. Was it the curtains? Yeah, Star Wars. Star curtains Wars curtains that my mom made. So for I loved the curtains because you know, Mama loves Star Wars. Yeah. But um, and his room was painted blue. Why wouldn't it be blue? It was a blue. I think it was room. like two shades of blue, wasn't it? It was like a light blue and a dark blue. I don't remember. He and it was an old house from like the yeah, late 1800s. He lived in a three story house. Yeah, from like 1890 something it was built. It and was, it had the really thick hardwood floors. And you had to be very careful watching because you could easily end up with an inch long splinter in your. And his bathroom was like a death bathroom. Yes, lots it's of like, marble. You know when people see these bathrooms with the giant clawfoot tub and everything's marble and they're like, ooh, it's amazing? I'm like, 
Well, I, I have had near death experiences in those in that bathroom at his house. Like even yeah. when we used to you, visit we after had, we had we had rugs and stuff down on the. It kitchen. still wasn't good. I mean, water on marble is not a good thing. Yeah, and then well, you're trying to you get have, in and out the, of a you have the um, giant the rugs. You have bathroom and, rugs with the with the rubber underneath it, so they're they're like that, so they don't slide. Listen, maybe I've always been a little danger prone, but. Uh, it was very scary bathroom for me, even as an adult. <laughs> I'd be like, eh, I guess I gotta take a bath. Ugh. Guess I gotta yeah, and we go in there and we risk didn't have my a life. shower. It was just the club. It was just the had like tub. a little had like a little a hand, thing on a handle. Wash your hair, but that was it. Yeah. But it was a really big. I don't even know if I could get in and out of that tub now if it was. Still oh, it was a big. It was a big. Um, it was really claw, wide and claw tall. Claw tub. Yeah, I know, but the ones they sell it now are small. Feet. <laughs> the ones that they sell modern days are smaller than that. Yeah. Well, here we are at the grocery store. Again. Again. She went yesterday and forgot a couple critical things. Was it yesterday? Yeah. You went with both the kids, both the boys. Yeah, that's not. While I was easy. working, I didn't expect you to go. Next thing I'm like, they're going out the door. Because I was in a meeting, and next thing you know, you guys are leaving. Does that mean you wanted to go with us? You wished you went? No. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh. <laughs> like, I wanted to go with you and both the kids. Well, you're like, next thing I know, you were store. leaving. I just didn't know you were leaving. I bet you can't wait to go back to working in the office. I right? am so looking forward to going back to the office. So I have a lot of meetings right now because I'm we're starting up a project and I'm the um, lead design on, on on all of it. So I'm doing a lot of upfront design work and having a lot of meetings with mo both my team and other teams to get details for it. So yeah, I I haven't had much goofing off time anymore the last week or so. Well, you were goofing off at that game last night. He's oh, playing. that was last night. What is that game called again? Oh, there was a lot of cursing involved, wasn't there? <laughs> yeah, he was playing um, the Mass Effect. Mass, I'm, I'm playing Mass Effect the... Um, three? Is it the third? That one? one's three. It's Legacy or Legend, Legendary. I think it's called Legendary. And it's got all three of the Mass Effect trilogy, the first. So I'm playing game three of it. And there's one DLC that... All the DLCs are automatically included in this game. Spoiler alert! That's not a spoiler Is it? alert. It's not no. It? no. Just the, the DLCs that you would normally buy all were all included in this package. So and they're all integrated, so you don't realize you're playing you go on a mission and you don't realize that's a DLC mission. So I'm playing this one mission that I had never played before. And and I'm fighting myself basically and I'm kicking my ass. <laughs> And I was getting so mad, I couldn't figure out. I finally figured out how to how to get through the the level, but it was I, there was a lot of cursing as I kept getting killed by my by my alternate self. Yeah. And and she, I can't tell if she's thinking it's funny or she's getting upset or whatever because I'm I'm cursing, I'm I'm stomping. No, my feet. it was stressful. Yeah. Because you won't because he gets stressed from it, but he won't stop doing it. He'll just keep. You know when you, if have you get, to get stressed, it. If you get if you get that stressed, and then sometimes you think, well, it'd be good to take a break, but he doesn't think that he thinks. That's not true. I do, but it takes it takes a long. If I'm not progressing, I'm getting really frustrated. I'll usually stop, and sometimes I may stop playing at some point for a day. I've quit games because I get to the point that I'm just so mad at Yeah, he won't play Binding of Isaac. That's yeah. one of my favorite games and he gets frustrated by it. But last night, I was probably annoyed and ups frustrated for maybe a half an hour and I finally got through it. Yeah. So then later on in the evening, um, I was one of the kids asked me something and and what was it? You said something like he, he's just mad at the uh, my, my son says, "Are you mad at me? Are you mad?" I said, "I said no." And she goes, "He's just mad at the game." <laughs> well, because was it the youngest? Yeah. He always thinks you're mad at him. He does. Yeah. yeah. Like it, he could just be being his regular self because Bob's kind of grumpy. I don't know if you know that. You know, some people have <laughs> resting bitch face. Apparently, I have resting angry face. Right. Yeah, people think that he. 
and people are people scared think I'm of him. <laughs> people are scared of him, like everywhere we go. It's so funny to me because he wouldn't hurt anybody. <laughs> I had a, I have a coworker who I was, I was, I'm friends with, and um, he was in charge of, of the like the QA group, the quality assurance group, and I'm in charge of one of the development teams, and. Um, one of he tell one of his lackeys, one of his junior guys. He says, "Go talk to Bob. He'll he'll help you. He'll 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 tell you what you gotta do." And the guy goes, "Oh no, I I can't go talk. I can't talk to him. You gotta have your ducks lined up and you go talk to him." And I'm like, "What?" <laughs> so my friend Mike and I are just cracking up over this. It's like apparently I have this reputation of being very strict and tough. I don't know. I'm 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 easy. He looks scary sometimes. I guess to some people, not to me, but because I've I've known people that I've had friends that I've worked with that didn't want to come over to the house because they were scared of <laughs> Bob. So I was like, I kind of like it because then maybe it keeps the, all the wrong people away. You know. Well, I've been protective of you before. Yeah, but I I've mean, ch I've chased off crazies before. <laughs> I mean. I'm kind of more dangerous than you are. Yeah, in a real situation, she's the one that's going to hurt somebody, not me. <laughs> yeah. I'd be protective of my family. But... And I'm the one that has to kill the bugs, clean up the dead animals, whatever you want it, whatever you think, whatever you she think She kills is the bugs, I take the bugs and put them outside. Because I always liked bugs when I was a kid. No, I mean, I had, some of them you have to kill. Yeah. But, yeah, I don't, I don't kill spiders. I just pick them up and take them outside. I love spiders, so... <laughs> the kids don't like spiders. The kids don't like spiders. They're haters. They're yeah. Spider haters. Our youngest son, every time he sees a spider, he thinks it's like some killer, um, it's gonna, poisonous it's spider. Gonna, it's gonna bite me. <laughs> it's gonna get me. It's like you see one of those little big brown spiders down the basement, you know, and he gets all upset. The house spiders. The house right? spiders. The ones yeah. that look like a seed or whatever. Mm -hmm. They look like that. What is that kind of seed that has that stripe on it? Anyway, I still got, you know, you know, like a month ago, I bought a new, I bought a new laundry basket just for doing the towels. And I don't know where that laundry basket is. I think it's one of the ones that are downstairs. I think you're... So people just take over everything that I, I buy? I think your oldest took it over. But that's for the towels. Don't I have, tell me. Tell him. I can't. I gotta put them in that and then make somebody take them to the basement. Yeah. Make them take it to the basement. I ain't gotta do my laundry when we get home. I brought it down and didn't put it in the wash yet. I feel like I want something for. Oh, I could have apples with peanut butter. So, what should we get for dessert tonight? I just said I think I can have apples with peanut butter. That's not dessert. That's your normal snack. Well, we had a dessert last night, remember? I made that blueberry. Yeah, it was thing. good. It wasn't as good as last time because it didn't have the nuts in it, but it was still good. You know, I wonder if I accidentally... I did the cement... The cement. I did the cinnamon the same way that it said this time. I mean, only in half because I did a half size. Mm -hmm. I w and it was... So it was a teaspoon. Like, if it was the full amount, it would be two teaspoons. I wonder if I did a tablespoon. I wonder if I did two tablespoons last time. Oh, I liked it. I love cinnamon. And... Um... Yeah, you thought it was too cinnamony last time. Maybe you put the wrong amount in. I don't remember. Yeah. But, um, yeah. So we're going to go see, this weekend we're going to go see a friend of ours. Yep. Some friends of ours go have some dinner. The thing we didn't do last weekend. And uh, chatted it. Are we going over there afterwards? I think we're going over there and then following them to the restaurant. And then we're going to go hang out on the patio. I always say cocktails on the veranda. We're going to have cocktails on the veranda. Their patio? At yeah. Their place? Okay. Yeah. Well. But yeah, we should go into the grocery store. So we hope you're having a good day and we'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye.